Did you know that prominent investor Kathy Wood recently outlined her predictions for Tesla's future? Wood's valuations for Tesla are those of an extremely optimistic investor, as befits her reputation as a Tesla bull. Listen to what Kathy Wood has to say about Tesla's future by tuning in and keeping on the screen. There is ongoing discussion as to whether or not Tesla is undervalued. The sudden drop in the EV company's stock price has alarmed the company's backers. Despite this, many Tesla bulls anticipate a rapid increase in Tesla stock due to the company's many forthcoming breakthroughs. Find out Kathy Wood's prediction for Tesla in today's video. We just released a report with our long-term forecast, and while the figures have increased significantly, we still believe the stock is grossly undervalued. That's because, as Kathy Wood explains in a recent interview, two assumptions have changed in the last couple of reports. Who is Kathy Wood, and why does what she says about the economy matter? Forbes calls American investor Kathy Wood a star stock picker and the founder, CEO, and CIO of ARK Invest, a firm with $60 billion in assets that puts money into emerging technologies like autonomous vehicles and genomics. Not only is Kathy Wood extremely convincing in her investment arguments, but she also has the results to back up her shockingly perceptive statements, leading many to proclaim her the most underestimated investor in the game. Kathy Wood discusses monetary and economic policy, innovations, future expectations in her area, and comments on Fed decisions in her monthly updates. The Federal Reserve System, or the Fed, is the central bank of the United States and is responsible for overseeing the nation's economy and financial markets. ARK Invest, short for ARK Investment Management, LLC, is a firm based in St. Petersburg, Florida, United States, that manages a number of actively managed exchange-traded funds. ARK Invest caters only to those looking for investment solutions in the public markets and who are interested in long-term success through disruptive innovation. The firm managed $50 billion in assets as of February 2021. American investor Kathy Wood, who is sometimes termed the most underestimated investor in the game due to the persuasiveness of her investing arguments, created and manages ARK Invest. However, she has empirical evidence to support her unexpectedly perceptive assertions. Wood reportedly sold her Tesla shares earlier this year, but she has since bought more shares following a price drop. Her ETFs made large purchases of Tesla stock in early June. ARK New Internet ETF Generation the Autonomous Technology and Robotics Exchange Traded Fund, ETF, ARK purchased 107 shares of. According to the most recent report from ARK Investment Management, ARK has purchased 1,893 shares. In 2026, investors anticipate a price of $4,600 for a share of Tesla. The stock of Elon Musk's company is now trading at around $7 per share, so this is a significant premium. Kathy Wood has lost billions of dollars as interest rates have risen and beaten down risky stocks in recent months. As of the start of the second quarter of 2022, the value of her equity holdings had decreased from $33 billion at the end of 2021 to about $23 billion. Wood increased his equity holdings by buying 140 shares and decreased his holdings by selling 167 shares over the time frame. At the end of the first quarter of 2022, Tesla, Incorporated, C Limited, and Roblox Corporation were some of the best performing equities in the ARK portfolio. Wood has increased her stakes in growth bets, despite ARK Investment Management's recent struggles. Wood recently criticized the Federal Reserve for being too aggressive with an interest rate hike during a webinar appearance. He pointed out that the world economy had already entered a recession and that the recent spike in stock volatility was an indication of investor worry. Wood pointed out the many warning signs of an impending bear market, including attempts to short innovative companies as an example. Case in point, according to Wood, these thugs will be coerced into covering their faces. For the past year and a half, Wood's main investment has been in Tesla. The fact that the stock rose in value in 2021, when many of her other significant holdings fell in value, is helpful. With the electric vehicle manufacturer's stock down 43% from its high wood as a buyer, ARK frequently sold shares of the company to water her weeds during the slump.
Even though most major automakers are now targeting the EV market, Tesla continues to have a commanding lead. Tesla is on the right track with their product. The number of electric vehicles sold worldwide doubled to 6.6 .6 million in 2021, setting a new record as the cost of gasoline skyrocketed and competitors failed to keep up with Tesla's private supercharger network of charging stations. The International Energy Agency reports that first-quarter EV sales increased 75% year-on-year, and Elon Musk's Tesla is the most prominent electric vehicle company. Tesla had a record-breaking first quarter, both in terms of sales and profits, which increased by nearly 4 percentage points year-over-year year despite rising costs for key inputs. Wood has an extremely optimistic outlook on electric vehicles in general and Tesla in particular. According to ARK Invest's updated stock model, Tesla shares will be valued an astounding $4,600 by 2026, about a 560% increase from today, as was mentioned before. The price of Tesla stock has recently increased by 0.2% to $721.64. Wood is so confident in the EV market that she makes consistent purchases of the stock. As of the 21st of June, it has a cumulative weight of 7.23% across all ARK Invest ETS, making it the largest position. Which do you believe, that Tesla is overpriced or underpriced? Add your two cents to the discussion down below. One of Kathy Wood's bull cases for Tesla in the old model predicted that the electric vehicle manufacturer would lose one-third of the market share it held in 2018, or 17% of the worldwide market share, including China. In the past year, however, that percentage has risen to 18%. Wood had this to say when asked how she felt about established automakers challenging Tesla in the electric vehicle market. She thinks they're doing a terrible job. As a result of not following Tesla's lead and descending the consumer electronics cost curve, they are falling behind on the front of battery technology. She mentioned how Tesla's cell phone battery placement was formerly mocked because of the danger posed by smartphone explosions. Wood make it clear that the lithium-ion pouch Tesla use is far more expensive than the consumer electronics batteries Tesla typically uses. Because of this, any company that wants to compete with Tesla will have to lose money on every electric vehicle it sells. Furthermore, they are experiencing a decline in sales of internal combustion engines. According to Wood, Tesla's lead over its rivals is due to the fact that those other firms are just getting started. She claims that what they have achieved thus far falls short of the standards set by Tesla in the Model S in terms of range and other metrics. According to ARK Invest's CEO, Tesla also benefits from these three factors. Batteries are the first. Second, they've developed their own AI chip. According to Wood, when their analyst James Wong, who had previously worked for NVIDIA and artificial intelligence company for a combined total of eight years, saw the specifications of Tesla's semiconductor, he was blown away. According to Wang, Tesla's specifications on semiconductor technology are four years ahead of any other automaker. For Tesla's objective of full electric autonomy, this is crucial. Going autonomous is directly related to AI initiatives, and the Victor will be the one with the most data of the finest quality. While Waymo only has 20 million miles of real-world driving data, Tesla has collected data on 14 billion. Finally, Tesla is the only automaker that still provides over-the-air software updates to adjust performance, giving it a distinct advantage over the competition. Woods elaborated by saying an electric vehicle's pricing will fall below that of a gas-powered vehicle during the next 18 months to two years. We have already begun to record the declining battery cost curve, and this trend will continue. And the conventional automaker, too, if you consider their investment in R&D, as an illustration, Wood used GM. According to her, $25 billion in GM's R&D budget is specifically set out for electric vehicles. Given what's coming, they should be functioning at near-peak levels right now. Wood thinks Berlin, Germany wanted Tesla to build a factory the size of 200 football fields because they realize they're in difficulty and will have to make adjustments that would result in the loss of a large number of employment. For more of this, check out our other videos and subscribe to TeslaTube.